and heart and says his prayers by night may become a wolf when the wolf bait rules and the wolf is full and bright. <laughs> For your safety on our little excursion, please remain safely seated with your hands, arms, elbows, feet, and legs inside the train at all times. No smoking, please. And do watch your children. Are you prepared for a frightfully good journey? All aboard! Now leaving the safety of the Chocolate Depot station. <laughs> There's no turning back now. The journey begins here in what's quaint little town of Alkali Flat, Ghost Town. Once such a lively establishment long ago, now has met a terrible misfortune. Most town folk blame Alkali's demise on a murder curse, though the details of where such a curse originates gets, shall we say, a bit hairy. rumored the undoing of this pleasant little township, yet outsiders have trouble fathoming such a ridiculous tale. Here in the Alkali Cemetery are the remains of its more permanent residents. Even more so, it seems Alkali Flat is far livelier than you might think. <laughs> the dead still roam these dusty streets, for anyone killed by a whale wolf is also cursed to walk for the rest of their afterlives. It seems they are keeping themselves busy with their bones. It's good to see they are taking this cursed thing in such good spirits. There are legends of indigenous werewolves from local native tribes. Thought to once have the power of transformation in order to hunt for food, somewhere, somehow, it was soon transformed into a curse to the unwilling hunger for outsiders. Perhaps the founding of Alkali Flat was doomed from the very beginning. However, this could simply be a mere coincidence. A carnival has arrived here at Pollyanna Park, despite the warnings of the local gypsy caravan. Fun for the little ones at Trail Dust Town. It's the perfect place to get one's mind off of any silly things. Nothing here seems out of place. But then again, nothing is out of place. Locals have hounded Trail Dust Town and its marshal with the threat of danger looking just outside the edge of civilization. The looming darkness of what might be hiding in the shadows continues to draw near, creeping closer and closer, just beyond these simple lines and shrubbery. By the pricking of my thumbs, something wicked this way comes, or at least dead ahead. Out in the desert, one must be cautious of another peculiar rumor. Tales of skinwalkers and witches with the ability to take any shape and disguise. They even have the power to possess unsuspecting victims with just a simple gaze. Whatever you do, don't look into them. Fort 
trail dust. Trail dust town's only line of defense. And it seems our barracks have bitten off more than they can chew. These monsters have no trouble climbing our defenses with their long, sharp bones. It appears our soldiers' rifles are keeping the wolves at bay. But look how long. Keep your hands and arms about you. In this case, their bark may not be as worse as their mind. One might find sanctuary here in the Ravenhurst family classic farm. Tours are being accepted for any brave souls willing to escape into a nice, quiet room with the comfort and company of all those creatures lurking inside. Needless to say, you'll find the werewolf curse won't worry you anymore. <laughs> Our soldiers have fought well, but with very little success, especially when you're using ordinary weapons. Everyone knows silver is the best medicine for such a beastly appetite. At least the one. Looks like recently, despite their desperate attempts to warn Trail Dust Town, they too have found themselves in the doghouse. Here's you are the only ones left standing away from the truth. The truth of the fabled werewolf curse attacking the innocent guests of Trailer's Town. Your journey ends here, in Old Terrible, a silver one. The last desperate attempt to stop the curse and save everyone, including yourself. The world is a closing in on they're getting closer. Success is gold. Or in this case, silver. <laughs> Unfortunately. The mind has overgrown wildly with wood stains, and the blast has stirred up the pollen into the sweet autumn air. I'm afraid you have all now continued this curse. And now, every evening before noon, you too will find yourself hairy and hungry. However, every cloud has a silver lining. In your case, at least there's a steakhouse nearby. <laughs> As we return to the Chocolate Depot station, please watch your step as you exit to your left. Watch your heads as the roofs are quite low. We thank you for joining our little excursion. We hope to see you again soon. Have a pleasant evening. Fire con lobos. <laughs> oh, <it's just> you <laughs> guys are and happy Halloween. Never mind. <laughs>